breaking news, sit in menopause, and osteoporosis. Can exercise really change your bones? Here's what the latest science says. A new systematic review and meta-analysis published in the Journal of Clinical Medicine, June 2025, looked at 24 randomized controlled trials assessing the impact of progressive exercise training, PET, on people diagnosed with osteoporosis, osteopenia, or those at risk of bone loss. What they found is game-changing. PET, whether it's resistance training, aerobic exercise, impact loading, whole body vibration, or even Tai Chi, led to significant increases in bone mineral density, regardless of the exercise. This wasn't limited to one demographic. Positive effects were seen across different ages, genders, and baseline health statuses. The PET programs ran from four to 24 months and had two to five sessions per week. They included both single modality and combination approaches. Most importantly, the study emphasized individual approaches. They looked to a person's capacity, their preferences, and their risk profile. It was not a one-size It didn't just stop at bone metrics. Several trials also assessed quality of life using validated scales like the SF36 general well-being, the osteoporosis specific quality of life scoring, or the menopause specific quality of life scoring. These studies showed measurable improvements in physical function, emotional well-being, and overall vitality. A reminder that bone health isn't just about density on a scan. It's about how you feel, how you move, and how you live. Why does this matter? Because for too long, exercise has been framed as simply complementary to pharmaceutical approaches in bone loss. But this review confirms what we have been preaching. Exercise is foundational to bone loss, not optional. It's time we stop treating bone loss like an inevitable consequence of aging, start recognizing it for what it is preventable, manageable, and often reversible condition when we address it early and with intervention. Lift heavy, load your bones, prioritize strength, and treat movement like medicine. Share this post if you are facing osteopenia, osteoporosis, or at risk of bone loss. And by the way, every single woman is at risk for significant bone loss.